A false allegation can devastate a career. Johnny Depp's $100 million defamation trial against ex-wife Amber Heard began with opening statements Tuesday in Fairfax, Virginia. Now I'm not going to discuss the details of the case because the trial is just starting and I don't want to get into allegations. What I do want to discuss is what I noticed in the following video of these two arriving to court. Although very subtle I think this tells us way more about what these two are really like than allegations that each of them makes towards one another. Also, I'll put the opening remarks from Johnny's attorney at the end of the video. First, let's watch the video and pay close attention to each of them as they exit their vehicles. One, did you notice that he helped the two women exit the vehicle? Two, he took the time to put the vehicle seats back in their proper position. Three, when greeted with a good morning, he responds with a genuine good morning response. Lastly, he took the time to turn around for the paparazzi and gave them a few shots. How many of these actor elites actually do that? Now Amber on the other hand doesn't exit the car on her own. She waits for the driver to open the door for her. Maybe she doesn't know how to open a car door? 2. She doesn't help anyone in the back seats out of the vehicle. 3. She didn't even close the door to the back seat. Lastly, when greeted with a good morning from the videographer, you can tell that she didn't want to answer, and when she finally did it was a cold response. She didn't want to say good morning. Evidence will show that the clear implication a false allegation can devastate a career, and it can devastate a family. And the evidence will show that Ms. Herb's false allegations had a significant impact on Mr. Depp's family and his ability to work. In my opinion, they both probably did very strange and crazy things in their relationship. We will keep watching as the facts unfold and the case is heard in the court of law. Those are my thoughts. What are yours? Leave them in the comments below. Please share this video for education and awareness. For the Dumb Dumb News channel, I'm Dumb Dumb.